So there's an XP farm exploit you can do which will allow you to hit top level probably faster than any other method so far in this game. But there is a problem in doing this and today I will explain all. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe. So if you don't know there are certain enemies or bosses you can find around the map. These are known as elite bosses. These obviously drop some great one off pieces. They also give massive XP gains at the same time. Well guys, there is an elite boss you can find and farm pretty early on if your team's decent enough or you're a decent enough player and you will earn massive amounts of XP. So the elite boss can be found right here on the map. Now the way in which you can farm it is pretty straightforward. So this enemy is called the Trembling Mess. And the way in which this dude works is basically you take him out, you'll earn a ton of XP in doing so, and then you'll have to take out these egg-like weird things called the Endless Eggs. In doing this, you complete this encounter and you get that one-off reward. But guys, if you don't touch or destroy those endless eggs, this elite boss will instantly spawn back in on the spot. And the crazy thing here guys is, you earn XP every single time you take out this boss. So leaving the egg alone, allowing this boss to respawn means it's a constant cycle of massive amounts of XP. So you basically kill the boss, leave the egg, the boss will respawn back in, you take him out, you leave the egg, rinse and repeat guys, and you will earn an absolute ton of XP and this can be used to level up super super fast but guys and this is a big but and not the ones we like either the problem in using this is the fact that this game and the enemies that you will find scale with your level this means that if you sit here and farm this boss for 20 levels that means every other enemy you meet from this moment forward will be at that same level or just higher than what you currently are. The problem here is because this trembling mess elite boss doesn't drop any gear on level you will eventually be massively underpowered for the level you are at. This means your armor, your weapons, etc, etc will be below that of what it should be and is intended to be due to its scaling system because you're farming one enemy that doesn't drop loot, doesn't drop any gear. So you're basically your levels are raising, the enemy levels are raising, but your gear and weapon level is staying the same. This then means guys, you'll eventually get absolutely slaughtered everywhere you go and you'll find yourself at a stage in the game where it's very very difficult to equal things out and get things back on track where you have everything matching your level because everything will just destroy you and that's the problem here and the problem in using this as an xp farm to get those easy levels so yes although this farm does look great and in fact it would be a great farm if this boss dropped gear for you but because he doesn't it actually means this is a mistake in farming this. So for those I've already seen talking about this covering it labeling it the best XP farm in the game which could be true when it's detrimental to your overall playthrough I'd avoid it at all costs so yes a word of warning. I wouldn't use this spot unless you were in need of maybe one or two catch up levels or something like that. But farming this for mass amounts of easy levels guys, mark my words, will be detrimental to your overall playthrough and your progression. Guys, complete the main story campaign. That's the best way of getting onto world tier 3 where all that good stuff drops. Do that first before you start using any XP farm you see. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys, I'll see you on that next one.